the library has undergone a transition in the past few years. It's moving from a collection of books and a warehouse of resources to being a part of the educational experience. The Peggy B. Helmert Collaborative Learning Center has already proved a model for what other organizations can do for facility space that encourages collaborative and interactive work. Uh, I think that, um, what makes me want to come down here is just how inviting this space is. I think that the, the chairs, the, the tables, the lighting, um, the people that work here, all of these people are very inviting and are, have a welcoming attitude. And I feel like you see a lot of other people studying, which kind of motivates you to study. I feel like it just, it's the atmosphere on top of um, the innovativeness of the uh, aesthetics of the room and the space that make it a um, good place to study, and that's why I study here. I would say whenever I go to the library, something that I really benefit from is the rooms that you can reserve with whiteboards in them because a lot of times, even if I'm not working on a group project, it'll be good to like write out problems or whatever if I'm like studying with a friend or a couple people. So it's really nice to be able to have that space where you can like do whatever you need to do on the boards. It's really nice. Gallows World is 20 unique themes across seven locations in all three of OU's campuses. The primary purpose of the fifth floor renovation and the Gallios World Exhibition is to highlight our world-class special collections, including 12 first edition Gallios held by the History of Science collections for OU libraries. It's an incredible opportunity to be next to the works that Galileo put up. Um, I think it's an incredible privilege that OU has given us to be able to study next to like his original works and to be influenced by like the things around him. And you know, it's a wonderful experience to have. We're working with colleges and departments across campus to help them and support their role in educating students with things like exhibits, Galileo's World, the introduction of the Collaborative Learning Center, and other new initiatives, not only facility improvements, but digital resources. The OU Libraries NAB app is a great example of that. And the Innovation Edge, related to the Innovation Hub on campus, introduces new technologies for students and faculty to experiment with. The Innovative Edge is a flexible tinkering space that we have here at the library, and it really adds an extra component to, um, outside of the classroom that allows students to like use things like 3D printing and um, virtual reality. The University Libraries, in support of the mission of the University of Oklahoma, develops and maintains collections and programs that provide access to informational resources necessary to advance scholarship across our community.